What's up, YouTube? It's been a 6436 first awesome videos here, and today we're doing the tutorial on the GE AC 4400CW from 201 to CSX 5599. So, yeah, the type of blocks that you'll need. So, the first thing you'll know, get is gray concrete. Let's just skip six. One, two, three, four, five, six, skip two, add a wheel, skip two, add a wheel. So Let's get Posh and SI. Posh and stairs. Posh and slab. And wall. Hopper. Birch fence gate. And we also want and also iron trap door. So let's place in our posh and size stairs. Add in birch fence gate. Add in birch fence gate opened. You always gotta have these opened. So let's place in our polished blackstone. No, 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 not polished blackstone, polished endosite stairs backward. Up, upside down. Uh, behind this wheel. So guys, the music's coming in too loud. Just don't pay attention to that. I'll be right back. I'm going to go turn it down. Alright guys, I'm back. That's a lot better. So I don't fully get distracted by that music again. That's pretty much it on our sanders. Now let's add in hoppers on the wheels. So guys, add in these with slabs before I add the top of these. Same thing on the other side. I'm actually going to add in the strip area. So guys, on front, on the very front axle, you always got to have double stairs. And for the rest of this, it's just slabs. There we go. Let's add birch fence gate on that slab. So let's place iron trap door. Oh yeah, we also got to add slab here. Same thing over there. Same thing on this side. Keep in the same thing, which is iron trap door. Add 
an andesite wall above the sanders so guys we're actually building this in the yn2 paint scheme so like when i built the ge ac6000 cw it was the bc2 uh, it's a modified version of the YN2, except the CSX logo was outlined in yellow. So we're doing the outline YN2, which is actually in blue. Let's add this 2x3. So you want to count this as 10 blocks long. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. 8, 9, 10. Good. Now we added 10 blocks. Add this 2 by 3 in the back again. And let's add, let's add the rest of it with posh and decide. Look at that. It's actually looking nice. Same thing on the other side. Same thing with parts and the side stairs. So guys, I'll be right back until we get to the AC6000CW, be right there. Alright guys, I'm finally here, where the AC, the GE AC6000CW is. So, you have to outline these blocks in blue. Pretty much the same thing on this side. So guys, I'll be right back. I'm actually returning to the main locomotive that we're doing. Be right back. Alright guys, I'm back. So we have to use a blue concrete as our So let's take a bell. Because the AC 4400CWs have bell, mechanical bells. So take a posh endocyte and add a bell. So we are back from seeing the GE AC 6000CW. So now let's revisit this. So let's go to the front of the fuel tank on the right. three in the front and then two at the back so guys I like to add in the stairs first take posh and size slab so let's take posh and size slab Now to pause indecite right here. Add a gray concrete because we're adding our back wheels. The wheels for the back. Where's you always skip to? Add wheels, skip to it, and add wheels. For like the older versions of locomotives that Crafty Fox made, he used wheels as hopper. He used hoppers as the wheels. But for his versions, he used any sort of block that he uses. But for my versions, I use gray concrete. So let's take 
Pass Indesai. Now the traction motor that we did in the front. So let's take Pass Indesai slab so it can link to any traction motor. And that gets power from the GE7 FDL 16 prime mover. So let's take Hopper, use that as our Sanders, So let's add hopper on the side of this gray concrete as our wheels. Leave it area here because we're going to replace this with a horse and a side stairs. Same thing, add parts and decide stairs. So guys, the locomotive that you're making, so guys, if you're building these locomotives, again, it has to be from CSX 201 to, to CSX 599. Alright, that's pretty much it on the trucks and the fuel tank. So guys, let's take Cyan Terracotta, Posh Endosize Stairs, So guys, instead of just using spruce doors, let's use birch trap doors so it matches the color. So guys, add this pile like add these stairs like in a C shape but place oh yeah pass into size stairs like where this curved 
So let's get ladder, and rod. So guys, for our air brake hose, we're going to use Birch Fence Gate. So guys, for our coupling, we're going to take another brick slab. So guys, I forgot to turn this light like I did on the last video. So let's add a ladder. For our steps to get up to the locomotive, same thing on the other side. Now let's add the same plow in the back. Add a two by three at the back. So add so add birch fence gate. So guys, be sure these always face the front. So let's take a birch fence. So let's take parse and decide slip. So let's take birch trap door. Same thing on the other side. Now let's add ladder. So guys, I forgot an iron trap door. Be sure to add those if you're watching this tutorial. How to build these locomotives.
So stop here. So let's take font and the size stairs. So let's take another brick fence. So guys, we're actually adding the bottom layer of our walkable walkways now. So the first thing that you'll do is add dark oak fence gates. So let's take So guys, I'll be right back to see what the the W shaped rear vent is. Be right back. All right, guys, I'm back. So let's take bedrock. So let's 
so guys, I'll be right back again. Second though, so I, so I see everything is correct. Alright guys, I'm back. So you just add a standard W shape. So let's add the left side first. I'll be right back if if it is if it's correct again. Alright guys, I'm back. So Crafty Fox was right. So guys, I'll show you it. See right there? So you gotta always do that. Make sure it's always like that. Just don't pay attention to that. I was just showing you how to do this. Anyways, back to Minecraft. It's pretty much the same thing as the YN3. So, let's take blue concrete, yellow concrete, and you also want sand, not, not sand, clay. So guys, we're going to use Lapis Lazuli as our CSX logo. So let's add a 2x5. 2x5 of yellow concrete. So 
So let's take blue blue concretes as our CSX logo. So guys, I'm actually gonna check So guys, I'll be right back. I'm actually gonna head to the the G E A C six thousand C W really quick. Just be right back. Alright guys, I'm back again with the GE AC6000CW. So, you just have to like place a box here. I guess I'm right. I think the L shape is right. I'll be right back. I'm actually returning to the AC4400CW. Be right back. Alright guys, I'm back with the GE AC4400CW again. So guys, when I looked at the AC6000, you just make the exact same thing. Let's take Birch Fence. So guys, the game's not responding. This is even worse than the that we did. In So let's take black stained glass. Use it as our our cab door window. So let's take yellow concrete as like the number and lightning bolt because they do have lightning bolts 
on below the number for some reason. So let's take Dark Prisoning Slab. No, Prisoning. I meant Prisoning Stairs. Now, pause Prisoning. Not pause. Dark Prisoning Slab. I like to use this so it, so it matches the blue. So meshing is a warped button. So guys, I'm going to show Crafty Fox again how this is right. So, see right there? This end. I'll show you my version. There's not enough room for it, so I mo moved it right here. Let's add in our walkable walkways. Matches the so it, so it falls all the way up to the cab. So let's take Dark Oak Fence Gate. Let me collect this oat, this donut shape. So let's take black stained glass. Let's take black stained glass pane. And we also want blue stained glass pane. There we go. Now we got ourselves the detailed windshield. Let's take iron bars. So let's take Dark Prisoning Stairs. So 
So let's take smooth quartz slab and smooth quartz stairs. Let's make this two by three of dark prismarine slabs. Let's take white carpet. All right, that's pretty much it on the cab. Now let's build the rest of these walkable walkways on this side. That goes directly up to the cab. Let's just end this, the rest of this layer with blue concrete. Let's just add in the rest with clay. Take in three bedrocks, skip two and add one. Or add one, skip two, S add one, S skip, skip block, add two, skip block, and add one. Of course, the rest is just all clay. So let's take light gray carpet. So let's take posh and disguise slab. Let's also take Birch fence gate as our horn. Is that a three by three of oh yeah, posh and a size slab. Except right here will be two by three. Except this one, this will be another two by three. Where's Add two layers of clay, two by three of clay, one, two, three, four. So 
So guys, I'm going to look at Crafty Fox's AC44CW radiator. So, see this. So, that would be two harsh and decisive slabs. So guys, the reason I'm showing you this because I'm explaining to you all. So see this? So that's one, two, three. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six. So that's six. So that's six. Parse and size stairs. Parse and size slab. So let's take. Did I add in our horn? Before we add in all the other detail, let's make the CSX logo. So, guys, I'll show you Crafty Fox's version. Let's. Oh, guys. I'm gonna add something in really quick. which is our brake wheel. Let's add in our brake wheel before we add in the CSX logo, which is a birch trap door. Anyways, let's get back. So, so, Let me get to the other side. Well, see this? Oh, guys, I forgot. Remove these blocks. just replace that with a dark oak fence gate there there we go let's replace another brick fence so guys I'm actually gonna make it like this second all right that's now it's been that you guys been waiting for Adding in our CSX logo. So guys, like I did on the AC6000, I totally agree with just going back to the simplified CSX logo. So I'm just using Lapis Azui. No! <laughs> just put that blue concrete back. Do the same thing on the other side. Go like where this is. Delete that. Replace it with. Add three lapis lazuli. Delete three. Almost looks like this eye shape. There you go. Now we got ourselves a CSX logo for the YN2 paint. So let's take Birch Fence Gate, use it as our horn. Right here. Let's also remove, delete this fence above this one because there's one above there. So let's replace another brick stairs. 
with harsh and decisive stares. So, at six, one, two, three, four, five. It's just five. <laughs> I'm going to see if Crafty Fox is wrong or right. Let's rewind it. No, he's <laughs> just silly. So it's one, two, three. F no, no. One, two, three, four, five. So I'm right. It is five. So, Crafty Fox and I are both right. Let's add in the rest. With Posh and the size Slab. So again, same thing on the other side. Five stairs. And two slabs. So let's take light gray carpet. Let's take redstone lamp. Let's take stone button. So we want birch stairs underneath our light. So guys, let's take birch sign. Is like where the number goes. So I'm actually gonna see if Crafty Fox is right. So this right here. So we put this. I'm wrong. So it goes right here. So guys, I'm actually not showing you the video, but I'm just explaining explaining it to you. So, what else do Crafty Fox say? So, let's add, oh yeah, I forgot, let's add our CSX logo. Destroy that and replace it with a blue concrete. Let's take lever. Turn that on. So guys, now let's add in our cool exhaust, which is campfire. So let's get shoot from the create mod That's pretty much it on the CSX body. Locomotive body. Now it's so let's clear all items.
So let's take Loom, Black Banner, and Blue Dye. No, I accidentally got rid of my Black Banner. It's like a blue board around it and a blue pearless inverted. Oh yeah, we should probably have the number boards in the front, which is using a warped sign. You can keep them blank. You can number it one, but it has to be from 201 to 599. Let's add our locomotive model. Let's call it AC44CW. But on BNSF, it uh, has did the two zeros. AC44CW. Alright, guys, that's pretty much it. How to build the GE AC44CW from 201 to 599. So drop your comments below what you think of this video. So thank you again for all the love and support. And thank you so much for watching this video. And I will upload more train, train tutorials in the future. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. We'll catch you next time. Peace.